What's up, y'all? This is Polar One Channel, and today we're going to do sad piano chords in FL Studio 20, to be specific. But again, if you're in FL Studio 12 or FL Studio 11, you can still follow along. Uh, the interface is pretty much the same. So, uh, there's a couple different ways to find those sad, dark piano chords. Um, we're going to try a different way this time. We're going to try citrus. And again, you say this in every video. And again, you know, um, I do this so everybody can participate. So I use mostly stock plugins and whatnot. Uh, I'm not going to use Omnisphere or anything wild like that. Where can we find something piano related on here? I would have thought they would have had a separate piano section. Oh, yeah, here it is. All right. So let's just go through and figure out which ones are dark or not. Here. This is kind of dark. So, I mean, there you go. Care Big Piano, we could probably work with this. We can bring the BPM to whatever we want. Probably to get the vibe, we're going to have to change the uh, BPM at the very end. And again, I just start playing. Hit that keyboard, get you a keyboard, start playing. Whichever one out of those two are the best. Alright, this, this version. As you can see, you know, I line that up right and it saved a lot of time. That's cool. Uh, so we pretty much figured out the chord that we're going to use. This isn't even like a typical method. I'm going to show a second way to get a dark piano chord after this. So as you can see, uh, uh, the method one is just using your ears, picking an instrument and then using your ears and seeing, you know, is this dark and mysterious sounding. You want it to be an 8 bar. This is an 8 bar. No coincidence. Because you want that variation in your beginning melody. So uh, with this pattern, what we can do is bring it up to five. I'm sure, you don't have to make it five, but we're just putting it in the mixer five. Let's try the convolver. Usually the convolver works, but this kind of adds like a weird like after effect that I'm not in love with. But I mean. Another way to find a dark piano is to, this is probably the most popular way, FL keys. And guess where we're going to go? Presets. Guess which one we're going to choose? Dark piano. You can just do whatever you want with this one. I really put myself on the spot with these. Thank you. 
So there you go. Yeah. That's another way to get that dark piano sound. Man, this isn't the best example. I've, I've thrown down some way colder melodies than that. So let's just go with the first one. That's pretty much it, guys. That, that's really it for this video. I mean, I showed you two different ways. So I, I, I'd like to hear less complaining than more. But, uh, I mean... And then you just expand from this. You add a bass that makes sense. You add kicks, drums, claps, hi-hats that make sense. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. Subscribe for more. Peace out.